on whether or not to... Uh. Shut it over there! Madam Herda? Can someone turn the lights on? Of course! We only turn them off to flaunt the communing device. Huh? What happened to the broadcast? Madam Herda? Is this your office? Welcome! We're having some technical abnormalities, but nevertheless, I'm your buddy Albert! Today, Madam Herda and I will be introducing Simulated Universe, the Swarm Disaster. A big update to the Simulated Universe. That's right! My communications with Trailblazers often focus on the Simulated Universe, which is about to get DLC, a lot of new curios and events, and most importantly, the brand new Audience Dice gameplay, all of which will bring more unknowns to the journey of exploration. Ooh, I'm getting envious already! Long-term updates to the Simulated Universe? I'd love to give those a spin! Uh, Madam Herder? Oh, they don't pay me enough for this. Let's go with the safest sounding option. Wait a second. Madam Herda, was that even a choice? This, this now what's happening? Calm down. You're in a special version of the simulated universe. What? It's a version designed especially for you. No need to thank me. Your choice tells me that you're an enthusiastic individual. Today, you'll be testing this special version for our trailblazers. Not if I find the fire exit first. The, what's with these dice on the past selection screen? Those are audience dice. They bring additional path blessings with every roll. Choose wisely. Each face of the dice brings a unique blessing. Simulated universe developers. You're welcome. It was me, Screwlem Runmay, and Steven. <laughs> Didn't even break a sweat. First plane, unless I'm mistaken, this is connected to the swarm disaster. You'll be continuously exploring three planes of different stages of the disaster, encountering stories along the way. You might just be able to piece together how the disaster swept across the universe. Within each plane, each tile you see corresponds to a room. Completing a room mission allows you to activate the communing device and roll the audience die, thereby obtaining a blessing that corresponds to your chosen path and the face of the die. For example, the blessing you obtained greatly increases the damage you deal to enemies. <laughs> All enemies? Starting from now? Don't get ahead of yourself. The blessing only applies to the room you choose. Also, you can only move forwards. The tiles you leave behind will fade away. So, is there a way to skip to the last tile? Some of the audience dice do hold that ability, but you pick the destruction die. Each die offers different gameplay. You can get to know them a little better after the broadcast. Cosmic Big Lotto! When destroying a destructible object, there's a chance of obtaining a curio. But if it's destroyed in the process, it doesn't bode well for your HP. So, what's your choice? Come to Papa! What? Well, it's been fun, Madam Herder, but I gotta catch a fly. Ooh, gain without pain? Huh? Quite the recovery. That's beginner's luck for you. You seem like a good research subject. Boss domain? Looks like I can inflict a weakness on the final boss. Still, I'd rather avoid the decaying shadow altogether. You're a quick learner. Interested in becoming my full-time tester for new projects? Full board? Generous compensation? <laughs> He'd be an order, Madam Herida, but the <laughs> program needs me. <laughs> Second plane. <laughs> Piece of cake. Watch this. Remember what I said about new curios and events? I remember. <laughs> What's this? Big lotto distributor? <laughs> Fool me once, shame on. Huh? Pre repair service? <laughs> Gimme. <Give> ha! <laughs> <laughs> Cosmic big lotto repair. Interastro big lotto. Destruction results in complete loss of energy and skill points? Now that's a risk I'm willing to take. Huh? Looks intact to me. The eons are smiling on you today, Albert. What do we have here? Are these trotters? <laughs> so we can hang out with these trotters whenever we feel like in the DLC. Seems like the data was correct. Reports so far indicate that trotters aren't universally adored. Oh, you think so too? Hmm. I might have to research a few of you. <laughs> Ooh, I don't want to brag, but I'm the Simulator Universe GOAT! <laughs> Who's next? Wait, what happened? 
system down. Uh, you need to finish the three planes before the countdown ends, or the remaining monsters get a lot stronger. Uh, why didn't you say so? Because of all those blessings and curios you obtained through the lotto ticket. Not to mention your beginner's luck. Well, you'll probably be fine. <laughs> I'm a favorite. You see? Nothing to worry about for now. <laughs> All I gotta do is keep rolling like a champ. Enjoy the ride while it lasts, but don't get too cocky. <laughs> <laughs> when you're this lucky, the ride's never... The ride's over. <laughs> Told you. What am I gonna do? <laughs> when you're this lucky, the ride's never... <laughs> For a first time, huh? What the? Let's go again. Not so fast. This is beyond beginner's luck. Time for you to become my research subject. <laughs> Just a humble employee. I can be unlucky. I promise. You have power over luck itself? Oh, this is deeper than I thought. Still, that's enough for now. Whew, home sweet home. Now, just like previous Simulator Universe updates, this one is the collaborative effort of four genius minds. For the first time in history, our program is proud to bring the Simulator Universe founders together to answer any questions Trailblazers might have about the update. Thank you for your call. This is Scroolum. Unfortunately, I'm currently engaged in other matters, but I will endeavor to return the call when time permits. Uh, not to worry. Let's reach out to Ron May. I think she tried to get in touch during the test and hang tight, Trailblazers. <coughs> Let's try the man behind the audience dance. Steven! Hello. The number you dialed is out of service. Please try again later. Hello. Yeah, this is anyway. I'm sure there are plenty of companies where only one founder makes a public appearance. <laughs> no big deal. I'm familiar with Steven's workings. I'd rather he rest that big old brain of his anyway. Wish I was resting my brain. All brains are actually. Moving swiftly on, Madam Herda. Our trailblazers would like to know how the swarm disaster came about, how long it lasted, what people experienced, and how it ended. So would I. That's why I need trailblazers to test the update themselves. The more testing they do, the more fragments of the past they can recover. Well, how about this one? Aside from the audience dice blessings, are there any other phenomena associated with path alignment in the simulated universe? Well, there's never before seen path resonance, as well as path energy accumulation and path space. Sounds exciting. Final question. The commuting device is the cutest projector I've ever seen. Is it an IPC product? No comment, but the commuting device is grateful for your affection. Intriguing. So what's the greatest benefit of taking part in the update testing? Receiving blessings, naturally. Yeah. Anything else you'd like to say to the Trailblazers, Madam Herder? Get testing. When? Immediately. Understood. And finally, a request from your fans, Madam Herder. Apparently it's time to, you know. Time to what? <laughs> You say it all the time. What do I get in return? Thousands of willing and able testers. Ugh, time to twirl. <laughs>